this solar field is one of two projects that were just completed um, on Parkland Montgomery Park system. Um, combined, the two solar fields are about 2.5 megawatts. They're being used to power up a number of our facilities across the park system. These two sites combined, um, it's equivalent to about uh, the carbon dioxide um, emissions of about 400 typical American homes. Okay. So we'll be offsetting that carbon with these sites. These fields actually came at no cost to the Parks Department. Um, it was done through a power purchase agreement, which is a specialized financing mechanism uh, for these types of projects. Um, local government entity um, connects with a third party um, company who comes in and provides all the initial capital investment for the installation of the fields and then they actually own and operate and maintain those fields for a contracted period. The Parks Department then purchases all of that green power um, and we're able to apply it to a number of our facilities in our system. And that sounds like a significant savings. Yeah, absolutely. Um, these two fields, we're expecting that uh, the generated power is going to offset about um, or it will cover about a 20 to 25 percent of our total electricity consumption in a year. What are the future plans for other solar fields in the park system? So currently we don't have plans for any additional solar fields though we are a very large park system and you know there's a lot of land in the county that's parkland um, much of that is forested um, environmentally sensitive or already has existing or future planned uses um, so that sort of cuts out a lot of um, available space that we might um, consider for solar fields um, instead we're looking at doing more rooftop solar uh, parking canopies um, and sort of smaller installations we're awful close to the archery range and the the, the golf driving range, which seemed like there could easily be some objects flying over these uh, uh, chain link fences and into the panels and probably break them. Sure. Um, um, what kind of, of threat do those to do arrows and golf balls pose? Arrows and golf balls can pose significant threats to a solar panel. Um, our hope is that our patrons in the parks uh, who are using these facilities um, respect the solar panels and do everything they can to um, prevent their golf balls or their arrows from entering uh, the solar panel areas.